today. We had a change of cardio to try to spike my heart rate and things like that to burn my calories. So three days a week, my best cardio got changed, which is fine. But uh, now it includes sprints, intervals, and a really, really high incline. I did it yesterday and I calves on fire, which is why I'm on this bike. Like, I don't think y'all understand. I didn't think something like that could hurt this bad. But, feels good. I slept in today. It's 8 o'clock. I'm usually in. I'm usually leaving by 8. But, you yeah, know. Shoulders looking around. Haven't even touched them. Five and a half weeks to get it right. I'm excited, y'all. I'm excited. My workouts and diet and stuff is pretty much the same as it was when I was six weeks after my last show. However, we did add in pull-ups before every other workout and hyper extension so that I can't arch my back or build up my lower back muscles for back pulls because we just gotta get the back pulls right. And my physique is getting so much better, but we just don't want to lose out due to bad posing, which happens a lot. So five and a half minutes to perfect it. And we're gonna do just that because I literally practice in between the sets after before at the house working on my last spray. So that's the only one that I really have to nail. And I got a new model pose, so I have to nail that as well. But coach challenged me. Got two weeks to Perfect. Right here, y'all see me in my living room just playing with some poses. Um, I think I had just got back from the gym and I was just feeling like I looked decent and I just wanted to get in front of the camera and just throw some poses out there. I'm really, really, really enjoying this prep a lot more than I did the last one just because I know what to expect. So it's pretty awesome. Then right here, you'll see me doing a couple of pull-ups. This was actually like my second or third set, so I was kind of burnt out. So instead of using the sister, I just did some scapular retraction just because it helps me um, activate my lats a lot more. So you can definitely try to add these in. They are so beneficial. Then of course, we always practice in between sets because that helps with muscle memory and it just helps those muscles come out a lot better and you get used to it when you're on stage. I wish I did this a lot more before my first show, but you know, you live and you learn and I'm definitely incorporating it into every single day. I practice in the mornings, I practice during sessions, I practice after sessions. I'm just gonna practice till I can't practice no more because that's how we get better. So I just wanted to pop in to clarify that I do these exercises every day. Some of them I do take out, but for the most part, I always do my glutes and my hamstrings just because they were so much less conditioned than the rest of my body. And I really wanted to bring my best package forward. So I'll either start the day with these or I'll end the day doing most of these exercises, not just on Fridays.
All right, y'all, so that was the video. Um, I kept saying five and a half weeks out, which it was six weeks out. It's just, you know, as time gets down, the time lessens. So I did say that a lot. And the video is pretty short because I didn't get a whole lot of footage for this week. But, excuse me, I just hit five weeks out. So I have been recording a little bit more, and I'm going to continue to record more, more recording of my meals, my supplements, just stuff like this so you guys can really see the inside of the competition prep. I'm going to make sure that I do a physique update um, this next time, uh, probably in my suit so you guys can see the changes from five weeks versus five weeks now. I'm going to make sure I include a lot more stuff, but I just wanted to make sure that I kept getting videos out. So here's six weeks out. Five weeks will be a whole lot better. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Just, yeah, help me out. Let's get better. Um, I'm really enjoying sharing the process with the few people that do pay attention and that do like my content. Um, hopefully we can grow together. Thanks, guys. Y'all have a great week.